In 2020, Cleo Parker Robinson Dance will celebrate its 50th anniversary, 50 years of dance, culture, health, movement, and respect for everybody. Respect for everybody! At home, in the historic, shorter African Methodist Episcopal Church in Five Points for the past 30 years, Cleo Parker Robinson is undertaking the most significant campaign project of its history. 50 years we've been able to watch excellence in motion. Uh, 50 years we've seen a dedication to the beauty of dance in all different genres because of the power of Cleo Parker. A vision of Creative Campus, a master development plan that increases our impact on youth across the state, secures Clio's legacy, and provides a campus that matches our role as a cultural and arts anchor, an institution in the city of Denver. We are ready to have a facility that celebrates our excellence and showcases the vitality of this neighborhood. I am so excited to know that we started in 1970 and we started with just a little workshop teaching children probably at the age of three and having young kids who were in high school starting just because they love to dance. And as I think about Denver and we're in this place where we have expansive growth um, and we think about some of the the thornier sides of growth, right? We all know about gentrification, but I think what's also important is establishing a community identity. And I think when you think about Five Points and when people walk up and down and through Five Points, they know about the shorter AME building. So what I'm excited about is really an extension of that identity for the next 50, the next 100 years. The CPRD Master Development Plan includes three phases. The first phase is 23,000 square foot wing on the shorter campus, designed by Kurt Fentress. The new wing will include three new studio spaces, shared artistic space, updated facilities for the professional ensemble, and of course, more office space. You know, these dancers travel all over the world and then they come back to this tiny space that's too dark, it's too small, it's too cold, and um, it just, we can do so much better. It would mean a great deal for the dancers, but more importantly, I think for the community at large. And so what we want to do is provide more and more opportunities for these artists to develop right here in Denver. So we're not importing our art from the East Coast or the West Coast, that Denver really is a place where we're developing artists. Sending the message of love and yeah. peace oh, to these awesome? kids who are so enthusiastic <laughs> and wonderful. I really, this, isn't that special? this is worth the trip. Oh, good, good. <laughs> but that's yeah. what you do and what you've oh, always really done. It's it. not well, just art, yeah, it's yeah. art that yeah. has a meaning and oh. that kids and us mm. old folks uh, <laughs> really take something yeah, away yeah. That, that makes us a better, yeah. a better person. Respect, Respect for, for everybody. everybody. I love